Texas State students are facing charges tonight after a sit in protest a few weeks back. But as KVU's Kaylin Norwood reports, the students say the protest was peaceful. I had to reschedule my finals because going to jail. So instead of preparing for finals, Nazarene Freeman is preparing to go to jail. Freeman is one of four people issued warrants for their arrest for an incident that happened three weeks ago. One student, Journey Carnahan, has already been arrested. It all started with this sit-in, protesting the process for the removal of the student body president last month. Though they say the protests themselves were peaceful, it's what happened afterwards that police say crossed the line. Chief Jose Banales says the students blocked the passageway of two student government officials and also blocked an officer's patrol car and says they even went as far as lying on the patrol car. But Freeman recalls things differently. They got transferred because we kept yelling at their car. They were moved to a police cruiser. Um, students linked arms in a show of solidarity, but there was none. We were in no way stopping them from getting out of the car. Freeman says they were simply trying to get a student government senator to respond to their concerns. But now after these warrants, other student activists feel this is all in an effort to silence their voices. I think that they just wanted to scare students into not using their voice and not using their power and their rights to protest. I asked Freeman, who's now preparing to head to jail, if they do it again. Just because I've seen the other side of this, maybe not. In San Marcos, Kayla Norwood, KV News. Freeman and another student involved are planning to turn themselves into the Hayes County Jail tonight.